inaugural game of the season for the Upper St. Clair Panthers going against Cardinal Mooney in Youngstown, Ohio. Uh, meeting of the captains, meeting of the coaches and the referees going on. And the earlier game was a 4 to nothing victory by St. Clair's JV team. Goal scores were Shane Heil, Nick Chesco, Jacob Impelisseri, and Steven Lachelle. So a good start for the JV team. And after two scrimmages of one nothing victories, St. Clair gets ready for the games that count right now. Again, out of, out of section game with a powerhouse from Ohio, it's Cardinal Mooney. Okay, St. Clair will get the ball first. Captain shake hands and move on. And we'll be ready for the announcement of the starting lineups. As Coach Snyder gets them in the huddle, prior to breaking out, it's full team huddle in this year, not just with the starters at center field. Good team spirit. And we are fielding right now 11 seniors, 11 juniors, and two sophomores on this team. And we'll wait till they break the team huddle at center field to see how they break out. But they've been playing defense with Worthy, uh, Walker, Stephen Mackey. And David Steen. We'll get to the midfielders as soon as they come out. Breaking the huddle. Midfielders will be Alex Ponolite on the outside. And we got Joe Rust in the middle. Carson Lachelle the other side. And Phil Dormish on the far side. Two forwards going out. Joey Palladino and Jimmy Belak at center field. We're going to take the kick and we'll be moving right to left. Nice night on natural grass. And it'll be something different for our guys because we're used to playing on turf. Ball's going to go slower. It's been raining and sprinkling off and on during the day, but it's beautiful, nice, and cool. Okay. Ball's put into play. Alex Ponolite controls the ball, drops to Joey Palladino. Palladino to Joe Russ. Joe Russ steps around the player. And we go all the way to the back line. And I'm sorry, in the back we got... Michael Pizzone, Benny Walker, and Stephen Mackey and David Steen. So Mike Worthy is not starting in this game. He's starting the two scrimmages now. Ball dropped to David Steen in the back, captain for this year. Up to Joe Rust, out to Michael Pizzone. Pizzone looks up the line, intercepted, out of bounds, and St. Clair will take the first throw in. On the camera tonight, Jacob and Palisari helped me out, and this is Bob Pass for the first game of the year. Dropped in, Joe Russ controls, pushed, and it'll be St. Clair's ball on the foul. Dropped out to Ben Walker. Walker carries. Looks to Joe Palladino. Carson Lachelle makes the touch. Looks wide. Alex Ponlight going down the wing. And ball out off of Cardinal Moody Cardinals. Throw in deep in the attacking zone. And Michael Pizzone's going to take it. He drops short to Joey Palladino. Palladino changes the field hard. Ben Walker in the back with plenty of open green. Looks to set it up. Dormish tries to get the field. Dormish intercepted. Finds him now. Dormish carries down the side. Can't hit Belak into the corner. And Joey Palladino controls in the middle. Drops across, Pondline has a chance for a left-footed shot. Looks at the keeper, he bar bobbles it and puts it in off his own hands. Perry puts it in on the goal. So we'll take a shot from Pondline, putting it on net. Wet ball, skitters around, goalkeeper can't handle it. Ball in the net. So we'll give an assist to Joey Palladino coming across the middle. And Alex Pondline putting the ball on net left-footed. 
And it's squared away. one nothing. Two minutes into the first half. St. Clair leading Cardinal Mooney. Cardinal Mooney has a first chance to touch the ball. Drops outside. St. Clair will take it on a throw at midfield. Great way to start this game. Nice and early. Getting a one nothing lead. Traditionally, Cardinal Mooney has been a tough game for us coming out here or them coming to us. Strong powerhouse in Ohio. Ball drops back to Ben Walker and comes inside. Ponolite chest the ball down, misses the slide, called on the tackle. And the white suited Cardinal Mooney Cardinals will put the ball in just short of midfield. Pushed it way up. Referee's going to send him back. And again, as we said, there's been a light sprinkle all day on this natural grass. It got wet, skittered in. Goalkeeper couldn't handle it. It ended up in the back of the net. He had it at the post and then bounced it in as he scrambled. Belak takes the ball. Dormish running. Nice ball to the corner. Phil should be able to catch up to it. We'll see if it goes out of bounds. Ball dies in the grass. Phil Dormish works hard. Left footed back to Walker. Walker service inside. Slips. Belak puts it down on the ground. And it will be a throw in very deep right at the flag for St. Clair. This is where we'd like to see our guys go offensively into the box. We'll see what the ball ends up doing. Alex Ponlight takes the throw in. Russ makes a run to the corner. Ponderlite looks inside to the box. Does a nice throw in. Belak undercuts. Nobody black can get to the ball. Russ gathers it in and settles it back to Karsten Lachelle. Good ball control. Ben Walker, another nice service off of Belak's head. And just misses the left post. Goalkeeper. Perry will take, no, he's passing off to his back to take the goal kick. First goal kick from Cardinal Mooney. Sends it out, high, <clears throat> short of midfield. Alex Ponlight heads it back. Mike Pazone inside to Steve Mackey, to Karsten Lachelle, outside to Phil Dormish. He looks forward for Belak. Jimmy Belak battles for the ball, gets bumped around, loses control, and Cardinal Mooney turns it around. They got a couple runners up front that they're looking to try to send, but they, they can't make that connection yet. That's typical of a Cardinal Mooney offense. Pawn light looks inside. Okay. Carson Lachelle drops it back. Mike Pazone drops up the Ponolite. Tries to carry through a couple of white shirts. They make the block with St. Clair maintains control. Changes the field. Ben Walker steps up. Nice play. Another service by Walker inside over top of Belak. And Cardinal Mooney now has only one runner up front. They had to come back and help. Nine guys back. Ball goes out of bounds off of Cardinal Mooney. And St. Clair will take the throw at midfield. Joey Palladino stripped of the ball. David Steen to Joe Rust outside to Mike Pizzoni has open field. We got a couple of guys spreading the field. Nicely done. Waits for help. Sends out to Phil Dormish on the right wing. Dormish looks inside to Belak, tied up inside. Tough footing on the wet field. Okay, we've got a foul called, Carson Lachelle. Player undercut. And it'll be Cardinal Mooney taking it just short of midfield for a direct kick. Direct kick taken by a center back, setting it up. He's got it got taken down. 
Cardinal Mooney pushes everybody up. Ten guys up. Scott Matthews comes out, takes the ball at the highest point, and gets ready for an outlet throw. Looks at Dormish on the right wing. Drops back to Walker. Tries to find Dormish again. And Cardinal Mooney takes over. Change of possession. Battle the midfield. And Cardinal Mooney comes out of it. Outside man, a lot of black shirts surrounding them. And we've got plenty of guys chasing back. Good defensive recovery. Offside call. And St. Clair will be bringing the ball up right about the 18 yard line. David Steen looks like he'll be taking these kicks in the back. Goes short to Mike Pazone. Pazone comes up the left wing. Looks inside. Carson Lachelle unable to get to the ball. And Cardinal Mooney tries to turn around out of bounds. Unforced there goes St. Clair's way. Pazone takes the throw, drops it back to David Steen. one nothing to score. With 31 minutes left in the first half, St. Clair leading Cardinal Mooney. Nice stick by Joe Russ. Goes down. Joey Palladino takes the ball out. And Ponalite looks for Belak a little bit behind him. Good run, good look. Just didn't connect. Cardinal Mooney turns it around. Runner to the corner. Number nine battles. Double team. A lot of arm wrestling. And it's going to go... It's going to go as a direct back, kick back, Ramsey, for back. Cardinal Mooney going in. The double team, a lot of hand checking going on. Goes to Cardinal Mooney. Ten yard distance. Two man wall set up in front of Scott Matthews. And we're marking up man for man in front of the net. Number nine taking a direct kick. Chips it in. Short corner kick goes a little bit past the box. Goes out of bound. It'll be a goal kick for St. Clair. And we'll see, looks like Scott Matthews is gonna take his goal kick. Ready to sit it on the six yard line, sending it out of the box. And to about 25, 30 yard line, drops it back in. Scott Matthews will get a chance to look the field over. He looks for an outlet throw to Pazone. Mike Pazone steps inside. Nice move around the player. Alex Ponelli takes control. And Joe Russ sends it across, changes the field. Ben Walker off the touch from Lachelle. And short touch to Dormish. Battle Dormish. Ball control goes to Cardinal Mooney. Tries to go over the top. Looks for a defensive kick high into Steve Mackey's face. No dangerous play call, we're going the other way now. Pond light touch, difficult on the wet grass. Try and get your foot in after you're not used to playing on turf. And Cardinal Mooney takes it outside. Looks like the Cardinals have settled down here a little bit. They're starting to get some pressure. Joe Rust intercepts, sends Pond light outside. Misses the ball, tackle, and we're going the other direction. Okay. This will be Cardinal Mooney Cardinals taking the kick from inside. That box is real sensitive. Ball over the top, header down, cleared out by Dormish, and the kick goes over the net by number nine. Good feed in on the direct kick, and Cardinal Mooney has a chance on goal. Sends it high over the crossbar. Scott Matthews takes a direct kick, hits it to midfield, over top of Jimmy Belak. And Cardinal Mooney brings it all the way back. Goes across the field. Ball comes down to the center back. Center back is the quarterback in the back, takes a nice long drive. 
can't make the connect on his runner on the left wing, and St. Clair takes control of the ball. Dormish drops it back to Walker. Walker looks for a feed, goes back to Dormish. Uh, a few guys standing around, not showing for the, the men on the sidelines. Change the field. Pazone's going to look upfield. And drops into Joey Palladino. Back to the play, finds Pondelite on the wing. Pondelite going one on two. Works, okay. Palladino gets some help, gets stuffed as far as the, the kick goes. He's looking for a pass into Belak. Jimmy Belak putting pressure on the defense. Just a step here late on some of these steals. If he gets a chance, he's going in on net. Defense is in the back, playing with the ball back and forth. Looks for a runner, nobody out there. David Steen brings it up. Joe Russ steps in. Change of possession, playing ping pong with the ball here. And Cardinal Mooney drops it back to the defender, heads it forward. Walker heads it up. Oh, again, Walker took a tough hit from the back defender. Ball comes down. Pazone settles it down. Grass keeping the ball slow pace. Pondelite looking for open field. He has room. Sends it all the way back to Walker on the right wing in the back. Walker, Belak checking back to the ball. Dormish grabs it. Dormish driving into the center. A lot of white shirts. And Drops it back. Paladino steps in front of the white defender and gets the ball. Little chip shot almost set up for Dormish on the run. And the ball goes out of bounds off Cardinal Mooney. 25 minutes left in the first half. And we've got a one nothing score. St. Clair leading Cardinal Mooney. Pazone does a short throw in. Paladino looks across. And step in front of Belak. Benny Walker tries to bring it down, turns it over to Mooney. Cardinal Mooney center backs the captain. He also brings the ball up. Steps around Palladino and looks outside. Dormish hustles to the ball, sends it out of bounds, and it'll be a throw in at just over midfield for Cardinal Mooney. Subs coming in for Cardinal Mooney. And St. Clair warming up some bodies on the sidelines, too. one nothing. St. Clair Panthers leading Cardinal Mooney Cardinals in this opening test in Youngstown, Ohio. Whistled in, throw comes in. Cardinal Mooney chips it back. And Walker to Dormish. Finds Belak. Jimmy Belak strong on the ball, sends it all the way across and back to Mike Pazone, who has plenty of time, but makes the turn, passes, comes up to retrieve that, and Alex Pondelite gives him a hand, drops it back to Steen, trying to set up some open space by passing the ball back. Jimmy Belak goes up high, nobody with him. Dormy steps up. Paladino looks, and Dormish finds Pondelite on the run, intercepted by the outside defender and sends it outside. Dormat, Dormish does a quick throw. Paladino has a change of field, goes across to Lachelle, gets tied up in the middle. And Stephen Mackey steps in, makes a touch. Ball drops back. Joe Russ does a little shoulder move and takes a runner off the ball. And Pazone has plenty of field here. Not a whole lot of pressure by the forwards on our defenders, so we've got a chance to set up the ball control play that Coach Schneider likes to do. Walker brings it up the outside. Dormish looks for the runner, and it's Belak. He's there. Little touch. Almost made it inside. Looks like he tweaked an ankle. Okay, Cardinal Mooney grabs the ball, brings it up the outside. 
Coming up the right side, Pondelite challenges. Carson Lachelle steps in, slide tackle. Ball up. Lachelle comes back, aggressively taking the ball. Pondelite leaves the ball for Pizzone in an overlap. Goes to the corner, slide tackle, sends it out of bounds, and we'll have some St. Clair substitutes. Will Sullivan coming in, and Eric Seach. Eric Seach for Joe Rust. Sullivan in for Belak. So Sullivan goes up top with Joey Palladino, I take it. No, who's going to be up forward here? Oh, it's Eric Seach in. Will Sullivan up top. Sullivan in the corner. Seach again on the JV team, an opportunistic guy in front of the net. So we'll see what happens here on the varsity level. Uh, ball fed in. Walker. Sullivan tries for it. Lachelle charges in, makes a, gets a couple of hand checks, tries to carry one through three. And the ball comes out by Cardinal Mooney. No runners up here for Cardinal Mooney. They're playing like eight guys back. Hard slide tackle by Pondelite. Second foul is going the other direction. And it'll be straight up the center. Free kick by Cardinal Mooney. This is, again, a dangerous play that they had a chance before on Scott Matthews. We'll see what they do. Two-man wall. Short drop. Hard shot taken off of the wall. And it'll be a corner kick. Substitutions on the offensive side of the field for Cardinal Mooney. They're setting up this corner kick. Again, set plays can be dangerous chances. Scott Matthews in goal on the post. Phil Dormish. And runners coming from the 18 on Cardinal Mooney. Ball in. Set up by number 20. Ball sitting in the middle. Cleared out by David Steen. Will Sullivan working to turn the ball. Gets out of there nicely. Pizone carries and goes outside to Alex Ponolite. So midfielders have stayed steady for this half. The defense has stayed steady and we've changed the two forwards. And we're just about halfway through the first half. one nothing St. Clair. On an early goal by Alex Ponolite from Joey Palladino. Ball carried to the corner. Will Sullivan cuts it back hard. Goalkeeper gathers it. Perry will take a goal kick. He'll take his punt. Slides off the outside of his foot. Just about the midfield. Controlled by Ponolite. Sent to Paladino and back to Pizone. Seach makes a touch. Looks inside. Ponolite has the runner for Eric Seach. Ball's going to die. It's going to be a chance for Eric to get there. Goes out of bounds. And it'll be a deep throw in by St. Clair on the left side. Joey Palladino looks like he's setting up to take the throw. It'll be almost at the corner flag. Pondelike makes the run. Joey does a slip. And he'll reset. Drops it into Seach. Back out to Palladino. He'll do a service. And Cardinal Mooney player steps in and sends it out of bounds again. Okay, deflection comes out. What we called St. Clair is now coming out Cardinal Mooney. Subs are held on the sidelines for St. Clair until we get control of the ball. And Mooney will take the long throw in. Curve ball spins in. Nicely done. Controls to the open weak side of the field. And Cardinal Mooney Cardinals carried up the left side. Looks to change the field coming the other way. Change the field of open up some green area for them. Siege trying to put pressure on. Sullivan charges in. Okay. Stephen Mackey steps in. Walker on the bump. And the ball goes outside. Cardinal Mooney mounting an offense at about the 25-yard line. Feeds into the box. Steen heads it out. Palladino brings it down. And... 
Karsten Lachelle finds Eric Seach, loses the ball to Cardinal Mooney. And they control it back to the defense. Steps around, makes the feed, finds a man. Ben Walker steps in nicely, intercepts the pass. Cardinal Mooney controlling the play here right around the 40-yard line. Drops it into about the 30 now. Steadily gaining ground, looking for an attacking position. Drops all the way back to midfield to defense and sends it across to the weak side. Inside, Palladino does make the move, gets taken down, and it'll be an offensive kick for us. St. Clair carrying the ball right about midfield on the foul as Palladino goes down. Stephen Mackey taking the free kick from just outside of the other side of defensive side of the field, sends it in. Sullivan was almost there. And the keeper, Perry, grabs the ball in. Low line drive, just barely inside of midfield. Palladino dogs the Cardinal Mooney player. Sullivan, good pressure. Dormish makes the intercept. Taken down from behind, and it'll be a direct kick again for St. Clair. This will be about the 40-yard line. Palladino setting it up. Coming in left-footed. Short, Ponolite drops it back, services it again, looks for Will Sullivan. Dormish is going to get there, cuts it back. They were looking for Siege coming down the middle. Nice idea. Ponolite carries across the 18. Couple of bumps taken off the ball. Dormish brings it all the way back to Walker for ball control. Stephen Mackey looks all the way across with plenty of room for Pazone. Pazone drops into Ponolite, doesn't overlap, pushed off the ball. Joey Palladino steps in. And we got a runner to the corner for Cardinal Mooney. Ball dropped all the way back, serviced across the 18, and Lachelle steps in nicely in the middle. Palladino has the runner, Will Sullivan offside about the 40-yard line on the offensive side of the field. Only man out front, can't hide from that one. Okay, on the offside call, just on the defensive side of midfield, Cardinal Mooney sets it into play. Dormish makes the touch, turns it over. And the ball drops in. Cardinal Mooney controlling the ball, looking for some feet into the box. Nobody in there but black shirts. Looking for a cutter, never happened. Sullivan goes up, brings the ball down. Siege battling at midfield. And we got plenty of anxious St. Clair black shirts standing on the sidelines waiting to come in. Most of these guys have played almost 25 minutes right now, so they're looking for a blow, too. Even though the night's cool, it's pretty humid. You see a lot of sweating going on. These guys are working hard in the grass. Again, offside. We were lined up offside. Seach is going in. They had to pull Will Sullivan back. Ball drops back. Cardinal Mooney takes control. Play starting to develop between the 230s here, not going very much farther. This will be a throw in by Cardinal Mooney. Since Cardinal Mooney substitutes, we can get a substitution set in. So Pat Davis comes in for Eric Seach. Dormish is out. Jonathan Walsh goes in the far side. Uh, and Trying to pick up on some of these names on the change. Garrett Genter comes in on the left mid. So the way we set up right now, it's Will Sullivan and Pat Davis as the attacking forwards. Midfield, we got Palladino, Walsh, Carson Lachelle shot on goal. Little Skeeter, and as it skips off the grass, Scott Matthews in good position, takes the ball, takes the kick, clears midfield. Headed by Pat Davis, Gaz Sullivan on the run, shakes himself loose, tries to chip it back, and we'll take a corner kick. Uh, 
They're giving it as a goal kick. Tough call on that one. Okay, Perry won't be taking his kick. His back will be doing that. Let's go across the defense again. Ben Walker, Stephen Mackey, David Steen, and Mike Pazone. They've been in since the beginning. And we've straightened out the mids. Palladino, Walsh, Lachelle, and Genter. Matthew's still in goal. And we are a one nothing lead. St. Clair Panthers over Cardinal Mooney. Will Sullivan looks inside. Pat Davis on the run. Goalkeeper comes out and grabs the ball. Ball trapped by Carson Lachelle. Sends it up. Pat Davis working hard. Coming on the back check. Lachelle works through a, a leg check. Paladino looks up, finds Sullivan on the outside. Sullivan works inside. Tries to feed to the box. Pat Davis was there almost. And Cardinal Mooney turns the ball around again. One runner up front. They tried to hit him, missed. Ben Walker did a nice step up. Finds Jonathan Walsh. Tried to drop it in. Pat Davis was cutting to the line. Ball goes back in. Cardinal Mooney on the run. Two on five. And everybody kind of gathers back behind the ball for St. Clair. Palladino drops back to the shell. Will tries to send it over to Pat Davis. Davis chasing all the way back to the defensive side of the field. Ball sent up by Stephen Mackey. Cardinal Mooney looks for the runner to the corner. And ball goes out of bounds. This will be a deep throw in for Cardinal Mooney. We got substitutes come from the sidelines for both teams. Joe Russ back in at midfield to Shea Kumar for his first appearance. Comes into the top, replacing Will Sullivan. Jimmy Belak goes all the way back to help on a midfield position for Carson Lachelle to take a blow. Uh, it's a corner. It's not even a throw in deep. It's a corner kick for Cardinal Mooney. Fifteen takes the corner kick. Feeds way up high on the 18. Ball goes across. Genter sends up to Pat Davis. Davis all back to the goal. And Kumar was on. Ball got lofted over the top by Jimmy Belak. Belak playing a mid position right now, trying to control the center of the field. Bazone heads it. Joe Rush tries to send it back. David Steen looks to Genter. Genter changes the field all the way across to Jonathan Walsh on the right side. Drops back. Ben Walker missed touch by Jimmy Belak. Walker keeps the ball in on the far sidelines. Nice play. Davis checks back to the ball. And 19 carries straight through from the defensive side of the field. Takes down Joe Rust on a slide tackle. Referee's going to call. And we'll take a break here as we tend to Joe Rust on a hard slide tackle. Okay, Joe Rust gets back up, shakes it off on a hard slide tackle. And we're just inside of nine minutes. One nothing, Upper St. Clair Panthers over Cardinal Mooney Cardinals. Walker carries, has some room. Jimmy Belak drops the ball back. Stephen Mackey makes a step. Joe Russ checks the ball back. David Steen. Garrett Genter outside. Pizone in an overlap. Inside to Pat Davis, plays it back. Pazone taken down on tackle. And we'll have a direct kick at about the 25-yard line going in from the left side of the goal. One-man wall. David Steen taking a left-footed kick. 
We'll see what he does here, cutting it across with runners coming in. Nice ball. Belak heads it up and out of bounds. Goal kick for Cardinal Mooney. Subs coming in. Ponolite and Dormish coming in. Walsh off. So now we're set up. Davis and Kumar up front. Midfield is Belak, Dormish, Ponlight, and Joe Rust. And in the back we've got Pazone, Steen, Mackey, and Walker. Scott Matthews still in the goal. Had a couple of shots on goal. And still carrying a shutout. Seven minutes left in the first half. Uh, turn over here, Cardinal Mooney on the run. Joe Rust carries the ball back up, looks inside to Davis, hits the referee, works back on the ball. Number f Again, Pazone chips it up from the back, headed backwards by Cardinal Mooney. Belak tries to pressure, and ball goes outside. Looks like, again, they're looking for 15 as the runner. Not able to connect. Obstruction on Pat Davis. Ball going in at about the 40-yard line. Referee wants a restart. And we're inside of five minutes. First half of play, St. Clair Panthers and Cardinal Mooney Cardinals, one nothing Panthers still. After an early goal by Alex Ponelli, ball fed in nicely, big header over top of the goal. Substitutes on the goal kick, Joey Palladino in for Pat Davis. And they'll probably, we'll see if they push Jimmy Belak up to forward. Belak goes to forward with the Shea Kumar. And Joe Palladino goes into the midfield. Over top of Russ head. Tripped. Quick start, Joe Rust. Pazone trips over the ball. Fed back in. Joe Rust comes out of the pack with the ball out to Benny Walker with room. Finds Kumar, a little chip shot to Dormish. Dormish looks for Belak on the run. He's going to beat the defender. We'll see if he gets to the ball. Nice work off the ball. Looking for a left foot. Nah, tries to carry from behind. Ball stayed there. Battle by Belak. Working hard. Working hard still. Inside. Looking for Palladino coming down the middle. A lot of white shirts were in the box. Russ drops outside, Dormish services it in, Kumar's there. Ball drops out, Pazone on pressure, and the ball goes out of bounds. It'll be St. Clair's throw. Drops in the pond light from David Steen. Looks to Mike Pazone. Drops in, Joe Rust will get to the ball, and intercepted by Cardinal Mooney. Drops back to Ben Walker. Dormish, big swing in, two guys open on the wing. And Kumar tries a left-footed shot, past the tough one to bring down, but tried to swing it against the grain, went wide to the right side of the post. Goal kick with three and a half minutes left in the first half. One nothing St. Clair. Will be taken by the defender for Cardinal Mooney. Sends to midfield over the top. Pawn light showing a lot of activity. Works his way loose. And it'll be a throw in by Pazone. Finds Pawn light on the run. And tough luck. Beat the slide tackle, but knocked it out of bounds. Ball coming in. The zone comes over the top. Foul with the forearm. And we're going to take the ball 
from midfield. A little bit of a gain. Alex tried to push the ball away from Cardinal Mooney, and the referee let it go as far as taking that advantage. So Cardinal Mooney does the feed, big feed into the box. Scott goes up, one-on-one, -on -one, goes over top of the forward and makes a nice save. Sends the ball quickly out to midfield. Belak checks back outside to Dormish. Dormish finds Kumar on the run. Ball goes to the corner. Shea Kumar working hard. Checks the ball back. Looking for Paladino coming down the middle. Double team. Tough play. Good effort. Good thought. Ball goes out of bounds. White throw in on the run. Cardinal Mooney loses possession and Mike Pazone comes out with the ball. Drops back. Ben Walker. Uh, tough play. Had him on the run. David Steam had just a, enough of a stop of the ball to get the guy to run over the ball. Point Light drops it back to Steen. Steen looking inside. Goes all the way back to Scott Matthews. Plenty of room. Plenty of time. Nobody pressuring. And we're sitting here with a minute and a half left. Scott Matthews takes a low kick to midfield, headed back by Cardinal Mooney. Kind of a counterattack. A lot of arms all over top of Stephen Mackey. Battles through that. Joe Palladino bounces it off a defender, and it'll be winding down to the last minute of play in the first half. one nothing St. Clair, and St. Clair will take the throw in. Ball drops in to Pondelight. Pondelight looks inside for service. Has a cutter. Dormish there. Keeper can get there. Knocks it down. Ball's loose. Kumar looks inside. Headed up by a defender. Great play. Good reaction. Right after anticipation. We just had, you know, guy covering up for Cardinal Mooney. Big chance to win the last minute of play in the first half. Stephen Mackey makes a nice steal. Sends up to Dormish. Dormish looks to Belak. Paladino, ball bounces to him. Pondelite looks forward again in the last minute, the last 30 seconds of play. Ball tried to feed back, cuts it over. And Cardinal Mooney will control the ball here. 20 seconds winding down in the first half. Tries the pressure, double team, nice play. Out of bounds. Down inside of 10. We'll hear the countdown. Ball thrown in. Cardinal Mooney will hold the ball. Send a big kick long for no reason. Ball winds down. And we'll take a one nothing lead in halftime for St. Clair. Second half, few changes in the lineup. And it's St. Clair Panthers 1. Cardinal Mooney, Cardinal 0. We'll do the second half starting lineup here in a minute as soon as they break the huddle. In goal, Michael Hast in a blue jersey replaces Scott Matthews. In the back, we're looking like we're going to start with the same defensive crew. Uh, we got Stephen Mackey in the center. We've got David Steen. We've got on the outside Mike Pazone on the left and Benny Walker on the right. Defensive mid, Karsten Lachelle. And we've got Alex Ponolite, Joey Palladino, and Phil Dormish rounding out the mids. Up top, Will Sullivan and Jimmy Belak. Goal was an early goal about three minutes in. Alex Pondelite from Joey Palladino to start this regular season off in 09 for the St. Clair Panthers. Okay, looks like Cardinal Mooney made a change in the back too and their goalkeeper. And Cardinal Mooney will be moving right to left in the white. St. Clair in the black, left to right. And Cardinal Mooney will hold the ball first. Time started, 40 minutes in the second half. one nothing St. Clair. Ball drops back. Cardinal Mooney defense. Belak and Sullivan trying to pressure. Forces the unforced error, and Sullivan comes out with it. Checked by the captain in the back. Ball drops in. Number nine. Chips across. 
One man back, Pazone leaves the ball in the center. Lachelle cleans it up. And again, St. Clair regroups. Palladino looks for Bielak, passes behind him a little bit. He had plenty of room on the outside. Oh, Palladino checked off the ball. Ball goes over the top. Michael Haas comes out, beats the forward, and looks to settle the ball down, takes the goal kick, sends it nicely across midfield. Jimmy Bielak didn't get up in good timing. Ball goes into the corner. Mackey has a chance to cover up, lets it go out of bounds, and will take the throw in. Drops inside. David Steen getting pressure. Stephen Mackey, we, we're overloaded on the right side here. Ball goes back off the defender and out of bounds. Okay, St. Clair works the ball up. Belak chips it back. Palladino has room in the midfield, sends it behind. Pazone slips, recovers, turns the ball outside. Ponelite inside. Lachelle makes the touch. Good ball control. Palladino tries to drop for Ponelite with bodies in the way. David Steen steps. Makes the stop at about the 30-yard line. Looks outside. Lachelle has room. Dormish is going down the right side. Dormish inside. Will Sullivan can get behind. Beats the goalkeeper. Comes down. Sullivan goes over the top. And tough play at the 18-yard line. Dormish had a nice ball going in there. One step. And Sullivan gets a chance to chip it over the goalkeeper. He's still feeling the worst for wear on that hit. And... Cardinal Mooney tries to control the ball, looks outside for a step, sends it way behind his player. Covered from behind, it'll be St. Clair throwing it on their defensive side of the field. Drops it all the way back. David Steen has room to look it over. Services left foot inside the Palladino, across to Lachelle, has room. Held from way behind, makes the advantage, gets through the play. Dormish has room, pushing the defense back. Tries to send Will Sullivan to the corner and too far out of bounds. Okay, deep throw in on the defensive side of the field by Cardinal Mooney. And St. Clair sets up tough. Ball goes out of bounds, unforced air. Going inside. St. Clair, Ben Walker throws inside to Jimmy Belak, traps it down, looks outside to Pazone, who's stepping up in the play, nicely done. Pazone carries into the box, takes the shot, left footed up over top of the net, but again, well done, he has a chance to take that carry from the back. Coach Snyder's exhorting that play. Okay, ball coming out on the goal kick. Back defender taking the kick for the keeper. Still trying to shake off that hit from Sullivan. Comes out the midfield on the goal kick. A lot of arm checks. Ponlight comes through. Bring the ball down. Jimmy Belak tries. Ponlight comes through again. Behind Sullivan as he was cut into the corner. Dormish needs to check. Slows the play down nicely. Dormish takes the ball. Service inside the Palladino. Tries to make the play inside to himself. Forces it. Dormish working hard. Double teamed. Palladino comes out with it. Lachelle settles the ball down. Looks to Pazone coming up the wing again. This is where that flat four turns into three in the back. As we start the attacking, Walker steps over the ball, makes a recovery play. Mackey comes through. Stephen Mackey covers his defending partner, carries up, works his way through three defenders, four defenders, push from behind, definite foul. And Stephen Mackey, on pure hustle, makes a free kick right up the center. Ben Walker limping off to, to the sidelines here, looking for substitution, turned an ankle probably. Okay, David Steen takes the ball in the center field. And it looks like Ben Walker looking for a re ball is offside. Substitution, Walker off, Mike Worthy coming in. A 
Worthy's on. Let's set it up again. Michael Haston, goal. Defense on the right side. Mike Worthy, the sophomore, coming in. And his other sophomore center defender, Stephen Mackey. David Steen on the back row, captain. And Mike Pazone on the outside left. 40 carries it in. Number nine looking for a service. Goes wide to the weak side. This ball is going to get served in. Pond and Light makes sure he doesn't. Ball coming back. Left foot trying to work it through. Michael Hass comes out. Makes a big stop with the legs. Big chance there coming in. Michael Hass comes out with, with about the at about the 16 yard line. Makes a two legged stop. Ball over the top. Jimmy Belak on the run coming out. Big stop there to keep it one nothing. St. Clair seven minutes into the second half. Belak arm checked hard, knocked down, no foul. Ball kept in by Will Sullivan, and we'll take a deep throw. Dormish drops short. Sullivan tries, makes a turn around the man, goes down the goal line, feeds back. Pond light was there, nicely done. Needed that finish there to make it 2 nothing, but stays one nothing. St. Clair. Palladino dropped in. Mike Worthy looks again, gets it in. Short. Dormish working. Worthy lets it go out. Looks to throw in. Finds open field. Nice change of field. Lachelle looks inside. A little too far for Pizona. No help from the forwards on that side. So... Okay, midfield will set up right now as Alex Pondlight on the outside, inside, Palladino. Ball goes over the top. Michael Hass is at the top of the box, waits for it to come back in. Gathers it, goes outside to Worthy. Worthy makes a turn. Looks for space, hand checked. Lachelle comes out of that. A oh, couple of body hits. Ball comes out of there. Will Sullivan gathers it in, moves up the left side. Works hard, one-on-one, -on -one, gains advantage. Shouldered off the ball, hard, left shoulder. It's a push, it'll be a foul, it'll be a direct kick for St. Clair. Now it's happened outside the box, tough to see these lines here. Just at the top of the box, left of the goal. How many men we setting up? Three in front of the goalkeeper. And looks like Belak's gonna take the kick. And we're looking for David Steen to push up. We got three backs, seven guys up. Ball way over the top of the goal post. Jimmy Belak sends it out for a goal kick. Big chance. We're just going to make these opportunities. Put them in the net. One nothing. Rolling down to 30 minutes left in the second half. St. Clair still leading. Carl Mooney hanging on. Ball to midfield. Misjudged by Cardinal Mooney. Comes from the back. Ball drops back. Defender steps up. Looking for a service. A lot of guys who played a lot of minutes out here showing a little bit of the wear with the grass and the heat. But sticking to it. Worthy goes down the line. Looks for a runner. G Belak was there. Works through it. Long-legged trap ball comes out defenders carrying all the way up the field somebody's got to make a stop here high okay forces it and Stephen Mackey's there to clean it up looks nicely outside over top of Will Sullivan but it's going to die there so Sullivan has a chance shoulders it in stays in nicely done Will Sullivan working hard in the corner drops back to Pond Light change of field we got plenty of room out here but that's a long pass to make dangerous across the field worthy asking for the ball sends it into trouble and Cardinal Mooney comes out with the ball steps up making a save slide tackle nicely done all ball they say from Pondalite Carson Lachelle shouldered off the ball 
A little bit of play getting let go by the referee. Shoulder on shoulder plays. He's going Dormish has field. Needed to, uh, we had the outside in play going here. Joey Palladino went outside, the ball went inside. Cardinal Mooney, a lot of chances to carry the ball out. Get in space, Worthy steps up, looks inside, Dormish. Settle the ball, we'll try to get some ball control here. Belak has Dormish on the run on the right side. Sullivan needs to take him one on one. Taken off the ball, has help coming. Ball centered nicely, Belak. Keep working, ball goes out of bounds. That was a nice centering pass. Belak didn't get a chance to see the ball coming through. And the defender down in the box score after that injury timeout here. Coming off groggy, the defender, he came across the box and got clipped. Um, one nothing, St. Clair. Going to a three-back system. Okay, let's name it here. Mike Hast is a goalkeeper. Defenders, we got Mike Worthy on the outside, David Steen in the middle, Stephen Mackey on the outside. Coach Uwe Schneider trying to push up some offense here. Going with throw-in by Dormish to Belak. Belak looks inside, all white shirts packed in the middle. Sends it out, Worthy makes a stop. A lot of open field here in the back on the defense. Puts the pressure in for ball control laying in there. Different look for St. Clair. And we'll see how effective this is. Stephen Mackey pushing the ball forward. Nicely done to Belak. Belak bumped off the ball, still working hard. Gets space. Traveling, one on five, still working hard, but comes out of the ball. The odds are against you when you go that tough for that long. Steen drops it all the way back to Michael Haas. He has to play with his feet. No pressure, sends it over to Michael Worthy. Michael Worthy got to make a quick decision here. Tries to play it too late. Off the defender, works hard back. David Steen helps to cover. Ball goes into a goal kick. Michael Haas will have the goal kick. Okay, they're going to target Mike Worthy. That's coming from the bench right below us. Michael has to take his first goal kick. And we're winding down. 27 minutes left in the second half. Still hanging on to a 1-0 lead. Hash chop, chips it out to midfield. Belag looks for it off of White. We're going to go for a long throw at midfield. Substitution, Joe Rust. Rust working into the midfield position, and we're trying to unconfuse who's in, who's out, and where they're going to here. Yeah, Rust for Pazone. Okay, where's our defense setting up? Okay, Worthy's taking a throw. Throws into Palladino, gets a double team. Ball goes over the top. David Steen makes the turn, has to chip it across. Michael Haas, one-on-one -on -one with a... Player makes a big kick to center field. In bounds. That was the play. He had to get it out of bounds. And he got a way up the field. We'll see how long this three back plays because it's not it's given some chances to Cardinal Mooney. They're looking to go over the top. They're looking for a quick release, and Paladino finds Ponelite a little late behind him. Keeps working hard. Lachelle tries to force it into Kumar. Outside, white shirts everywhere. With this three-back system, they got to stay connected, and it's starting to spread out in the back. There's a lot of field to cover for three guys. Feeds through. Kumar almost gets to it. Big man, little man, run off the ball. Pressure upon light goes down. Joe Rust on the chase. Worthy tries to make the stop. Held from behind, and we're going the other way. Good call. They're working on the right side here, the right back, Mike Worthy. And David Steen takes the kick from about the 40-yard line in our defensive side. 
chips it, unforced air, tough in the grass, a scuff. Goes out of bounds and turns it over right back to Cardinal Mooney. So far their play again is get control, chip the ball over, and work on the right side defense here. Ball drops back. We'll see if they do the send. There it is. Nicely done by Joe Russ to step in behind Belak outside the Dormish is not gonna get there. The way to beat this again, the way Mooney's dropping back, Cardinal Mooney's dropping back is quick sharp passes. Work there a little bit, Joe Rust work. Dangerous play. But Cardinal Mooney takes control. Throw in by Cardinal Mooney at midfield, looking over the top, and they're going to be playing on his right side the whole time, going in on their left offensive side. Big throw over the top. Worthy gets back. Joey Palladino drops it in for Rust. Stephen Mackey has open field, tons of open field. Looks long with a big kick, finds Kumar. Finds Kumar one-on-one -on -one with a goalkeeper going in. Chip. Nah. Tough play from behind. Referee lets the play go. And it was almost a big breakaway on a big feed by Steve Mackey to Shea Kumar. That's the way to beat this. One nothing, 23 minutes left. St. Clair winning. Kumar goes over, makes the run. He has Belak and Palladino trailing. Ball fed in. Giving him too much of a chance to release the ball, and it's a long kick to center field. Okay. Worthy drags it down, looks outside. Phil has to make the play. Dormish is working hard. Big man, little man again. Worthy on the turn, carries it down the sidelines. Mike Worthy takes it out of bounds. Big throw. Okay, who's coming in? David McCurry up top for Jimmy Belak. So it's Belak and Kumar. In the mid, it's Dormish, Paladino. Big throw into the center, headed up in the air. Ball still... Ball still active. We got to clear. Okay. Take down and a hold right in the, right in front of the net here. It's a big play for Cardinal Mooney. They need a five-man wall. They're pushing him back for 10 yards. This is a big play. Michael Hass has to be up to the task. Five-man wall setting up. Okay. Three men trying to fake it out. Michael got to stay ready, and a five-man wall, set and tight, got to stay intact. Ball has to, is going to be put into play. Crisscross, wait, chip, okay, chip shot, everybody stood tight, Joe Russ made the kick out, the wall stayed intact. Holding on to the jersey, and as a trip, Karsten Lachelle were going inside, so the hold on the jersey was shielded, but the trip wasn't. 21 minutes, free kick again, inside the 18. Gonna be an in-swing and right foot. Ball serviced far, looking for the cross. Corner kick coming from the other side. Too many chances in our end of the field here, winding down, 21 minutes left in the second half, one nothing. We gotta clear this ball out and get some control up at midfield. Okay, this will be a right-footed outswinger. Corner kick. Big chip shot. Nice setup. Man goes up, headed it across. Played back. Good active play by Alex Paul and Light. Goes out of bounds, but it settles it down for a throw-in. Again, another chance down here on the offensive set play. Big throw going into the box. Ball goes over, Michael Haas comes out, makes the save high at the highest point. Ball nicely done to Mike Worthy. Worthy got to get there. Haas field, send it. Nicely done, David, get there. Okay, everybody was exhorting a quick release. It came outside to Mike Worthy, went up forward looking for David McCurry and didn't get a touch. 
Ball drops back. Kumar dogging him. Keep the pressure on these defenders. Phil Dormish pushing up. Okay, ball goes out of bounds on an unforced error again. Okay, pawn light out. And we got John Walsh coming in. Matthew Hast is in. Some fresh legs trying to get a different look here. Ball dropped across, taken off of Joe Rust on a runner. David Steen came back nicely, beat Stephen Mackey here. Recovers, helps out Joe Rust. Get up, watch a shot. Everybody chasing on these substitutions here. We haven't settled down into where we're supposed to be playing. A lot of guys chasing the ball. Worthy comes outside, sends it out of bounds to regroup. St. Clair got to regroup here with 19 minutes left. Okay, we'll set up the lineup as soon as we get a break, but another offensive throw. Big throw, taking about five yards, 10 yards off the line. He's gonna be thrown deep in. Low, Pat Davis steps up, needs to get to the ball. Joe Rust, nicely done. McCur another direct kick, this is amazing. Where that call came from, we'll see, but Okay, direct kick just outside the 18, second chance. 18 minutes left. Big chance again for Cardinal Mooney. A lot of offensive firepower here on referees pulling them back 10 yards. Five-man wall. It's going to be a big hooking shot. Got to be up for the task here. Big chip on the outside. Header misses wide. Four guys charging from the 18, had the inside track, and it was a chip shot that was a header that went wide. Okay, let's set it up now here. Michael has to take the goal kick in the back. We got Worthy, Steen, Mackey. Matthew Haas comes back. They're going to a four-man back. Matthew's on the inside. Pondalite's coming. Okay, we push. Okay, here we go. Four-man back. Pond light, Mackey, Steen, Worthy. In the mids, we got Matthew Hast, Pat Davis. I'm sorry, Matthew Hast, Paladino. Drops it back to Pond light, Phil Dormish. And on the outside, we got Jonathan Walsh, Matthew Hast. Okay, wants Matthew to stay in a defensive mid position. Okay, Coach Snyder now is set up with a four-man back with a defensive mid position. And we're pushing up Walsh and Davis and McCurry. So this is, again, different situation here, 3-3 three, three, and 4. Ball comes in, goalkeeper muffs it. Taken out by Pat Davis. Keepers down. And Pat Davis going for the ball, collides with the goalkeeper, keeper down. And time back in on the injury on the goalkeeper. He's back up. He's bent over, but he's staying in the game. Defenders taking the kick, and we've got 16 minutes left in the half. one nothing. St. Clair hanging on by a thread. Big kick over across midfield. Matthew Hast goes up, brings the ball down. David McCurry battles for it. And we've got some active legs in there. This will this will be a test here to see if we can regenerate some offense. Ball turned over. Good touches by Cardinal Mooney. 15 drops it in. David Steen carries across the middle. Clears out. We need pressure from David McCurry up front. So nobody with him. Single man up front. Ball drops out to the outside, and it'll be St. Clair taking the throw in. Okay, we'll keep giving you the wind down here. 15 minutes left, one nothing. St. Clair. Throw in by St. Clair. Pond light goes over the top. Ball drops in. Jonathan Walsh comes out of there with it. On the foul, on the grab, St. Clair will take the free kick. A little bit of disorganization in the beginning of this second half here has led to, again, the activity of 
Cardinal Mooney having several chances on the D, on the offensive side of the field, inside the 18, a bunch of throws, a bunch of corner kicks. And Ponelite told to carry the ball back on his side of the midfield and drops it back to David Steen. Steen has room, looks to set up the service, goes way over the top, David McCurry looking, doesn't get there, Matthew has chest down, controls the ball. Tough to open field. Pat Davis steps in, drags it all the way back to David Steen. And we're playing a little bit of keep away here to get some ball control and some momentum back. Matthew Haas steps in nicely, sends to David McCurry with his back to the goal. Need to move this ball forward and get some chances. Worthy calls for the ball outside. Goes up to Pat Davis. Tough touch, makes a stop before it goes out of bounds. Good centering ball. Where's Walsh? Matthew, take that shot. Let's see what happens. Services it through. Squibber, goalkeeper fumbles it. Nobody following. Okay, good take by Matthew Haas. Rolls it in there. Clears midfield. Haas again traps with his leg. Cardinal Mooney comes out of there. Ball steps in, chips outside. Sets up for Cardinal Mooney. Walsh on the stop. Sends it all the way back past midfield to restart. And forces the carry in. Unforced there. Worthy needs to be ready to, okay, get some open field. Controls the ball. Sends to the corner. Ball's going to die there. That's nice. Oh, an offside. Okay, David McCurry called on an offside call a little bit late. But coming back the other way. Winding down on 13 minutes left in the second half. one nothing, hanging in there. Ball's going to go big over the top. Captain taking the kick. Okay. Everybody's at about the 20-yard line, forcing the offside. It's going big over the top. Michael Haas comes out. Punches it, works the ball through, and it'll be a throw in. A lot of traffic in front. We knew that feed was going to go over the top with a big kick by the captain. A lot of guys tracking back and making that an onside play. Michael Hass comes out of the pack, and ball goes out of bounds. Okay, it'll be thrown in by Cardinal Mooney at about the 25-yard line. Dropped inside. Chested down. Okay, now we've got a couple more substitutes. Pizzone is back in. Sean Pulaski in at the midfield position. Lots of new faces. Again, getting trying to get reorganized here. Stephen Mackey, Mark Mackey. Ball safe. Matthew Haas steps up. Didn't make... Just enough to dislodge the play. Eric Siege comes out under the ball. And Alex Ponlight from the back line carries up. Taken down. We'll take the foul call. And we're going in on an offensive play. Let's set this up again here. We got a bunch of changes in faces here. Pazone right outside. Mackey inside. Steen inside. And Ponlight on the left side defense. Michael Haston net. Coming through with some big saves in the second half here. Ball goes over the top by Ponalite. And in the midfield, Matthew Hast. Mark Mackey. Karsten Lachelle. Sean Pulaski. So a lot of new faces in there. Mackey. Mark Mackey on the outside. Drops into Eric Seach. And Seach has Pulaski. Seach takes the shot. Goalkeeper drags it down to the ground. And we're winding inside of 11 minutes. Okay, ball comes over the top. Carson Lachelle brings it down. Pulaski running on the ball. Everybody hanging back, trying to play defense. Ball getting forced around. Seach trying to get pressure on the defense. And space being created by Cardinal Mooney. Inside pass, missed. Lachelle comes back. Ball fed through. Mackey does the intercept and sends back out to midfield. Tough pass, wide open shot. Man takes it. 
Over the top of the crossbar. Again, another chance from the 18. You got, again, Coach Schneider exhorting our guys to tighten up this defense, figure this out, and get some bodies in front of the ball. We're taking pot shots at the net. First half shots were probably about four. We've probably got about 10 right now against. Michael Haas takes the kick from his goal line, sends it up. Nobody there but a white shirt off the referee. Ball drops back. Okay, we're trying to keep, again, a tight defense. Ball up. Steen goes up. Matthew Haas comes through. Nice body. Body takes the man, but the ball was there on the effort. No call. We're coming back in. Big feet over the top. Trap on the back of the player. Pazone carries. Need some bodies to be open. Pazone. Pazone needs to carry. Sends it over the top. Belak has it. Mark Mackey on the run. Left side. Followed by. Ball going out of bounds on Mackey's side. St. Clair will take the throw in deep on the about the 25-yard line. Garrett Genter comes in. Joey Palladino out. With an effort of new legs coming in with eight minutes left. one nothing. St. Clair hanging on by their fingernails. Ponelite looks forward. Big throw to the corner. Belak's there. Somebody needs to cut. Dormish coming from the outside. And they call Phil Dormish on coming from an offside position. Another one of these tough calls that you can't see from this angle, but very close. Okay, we got Belak in up front. We got Mackey, Dormish, Hast, and Genter in the mids. Matthew Hast makes a stop. Looks outside, carries it. Comes to Phil, good ball, turn it. Pazone has space. We gotta make, we gotta play ball control here, an effective ball control. Mackey makes the play. Unforced errors. We gain control of the ball, and we're turning it over at midfield here. Matthew Haas steps up. Okay, ball drops in. Good play on a recovery. Makes that play. Dormish makes that play. Good stop. Come on, we got open field. Find Belak on the run. Releases on the wrong side. Jimmy Belak was going down the middle. Ball coming over the top. Lachelle alert, leaves shoulders the ball down. Regroup at center field, and Cardinal Mooney will take the throw. We're winding down inside of seven minutes, one nothing. Pazone comes out of there. Genter with quick legs, finds Belak. Belak's going to the corner, he needs some help to follow. They got a pressure up. Belak still pressuring the defender, that works. Belak forces a corner, that's a great play by Jimmy Belak. Keeping the defender at odds and making a good play. Okay, with five minutes winding down, one nothing St. Clair, corner kick. Phil Dormish will take it. Jimmy Belak's the target. Matthew Haas, big target in the front two. Mackey on the outside and Garrett Genner getting the play. We need to find his ball and put it in. Ball goes over the top. Sitting there, yes, and Mackey. Mark Mackey comes from the outside. All the defenders were looking at that ball. Just a chip shot over the top by Dormish. Goes in the net. Mark Mackey, 2 nothing. five minutes left. Great play. A big play, 2 nothing. five minutes left on a goal by Mark Mackey from a corner kick of Dormish. Sorry. Okay, Jimmy Belak finds Genter going through there. Goalkeeper comes out, doesn't make that play. Genter dogging him now again. St. Clair's got some life. Trying to make things happen. Five minutes winding down. Two nothing on goals by Ponelite and Mackey. Oh, tough call. 
ghost call push gets the forwards moving ball played we got to make a stop here they're creeping in solid stops what we're looking for Matthew Haas makes a nice play in there controls the ball looks forward sends Belak to the sidelines ah, tough ball goes out of bounds on forced air St. Clair throw in Five minutes and winding. <laughs> okay, substitutes here. Let's line them up again. Michael Hastie in goal. Pazone, Worthy, and David Steen in the back. Karsten Lachelle. Matthew Hast. Alex Ponolite. Ball going St. Clair's way. And we got... Sean Pulaski, Garrett Ginter, and David McCurry. So a lot of faces. 2 nothing score. Ball goes out of bounds on unforced air, and we're doing substitution. <laughs> Okay, we're going to take a throw in here, big throw, ball goes inside, attacking position for, ball's going across, big feed inside and headed out by Michael Pazone, Pazone makes the play. Big take by number nine in front of the net. And Mooney grabs the ball at midfield. They're going to go long ball in, trying to make this play work. Still hasn't connected. Ball goes outside. And we're going to see the ball come up. Genter grabs the ball on a hold, hand checks. Big feet over the top. David McCurry on the run. Tough play at the midfield. Trying to work its way back. They're going to again try this big play over the top. We'll see what happens. Drops inside. Cardinal Mooney has possession. Drops it back out. Here's the take. Tries to make the play. David McCurry goes down. He's going to get carded. Okay, we're down inside of three minutes. Two nothing, St. Clair. And we've got a free kick on a yellow card to David McCurry for going into a slide tackle. Four man wall, Michael Haston net. And we got to stay tough. Okay. Here we go again. A lot of tired legs out there for Cardinal Mooney. Not a whole lot of substitution. Ball's in play. Michael Haas centers himself in the net with a four-man wall. Ball's got to wall's got to stay intact is the key element. Big kick out of bounds. We'll take that. Two and a half minutes winding down. Two nothing. St. Clair. Goals by Ponolite from Paladino. Mark Mackey from Phil Dormish, and Michael Haas will be bringing it out. Two minutes left. Michael Haas takes the goal kick. Drops short to Alex Ponolite. Looks to send long. Does get over midfield. Kumar on a chase. Matthew Haas steps in. Tries to make a touch. Comes back. Recovers. And ball goes out of bounds off of St. Clair. It'll be a throw in inside of midfield by Cardinal Mooney. Quick throw. Tough. Looked like a handball he got away with. Pornelot will take his time for throwing. Inside a minute and a half. 2 nothing. St. Clair hanging on to a 2 nothing lead. Big throw by Pornelite over the top to Kumar's foot. Garrett Ginter makes the stop. Sends across. Looks inside to Shea Kumar. We got Sean Pulaski on the wing. Ball goes out of bounds off a defender. And Pazone taking his time getting to the ball. One minute left. Ball goes inside. 
Genter traps it, makes a stop. Double team, taking off the ball, no call, no foul. Coming out of bounds. Good pressure by Sean Pulaski. This is gonna be a big long run. Good trap, Worthy working hard. Ball goes out of bounds. Cardinal Looney takes advantage of about 10 yards, drops it inside. Goes out of bounds. This is big change of field position here. Winding down to 30 seconds. Pazone's coming up to make the play. And he'll take a long throw in. We've got to get on the offensive side of the field just to preserve 2 nothing. Ball drops in. Goes out of bounds. Another throw in for St. Clair. And Pazone will go long again. 20 seconds. Over the top. Out of bounds. One more time and should be enough for St. Clair to get into the offensive zone and wind down the clock. You're hearing the countdown. Pazone takes the long throw, goes to the corner, eats the time up, and it's a first game victory in the regular season. 2-0 St. Clair decisively over Cardinal Mooney. Take the scoreboard. Man. Scoreboard shows two. St. Clair goals by Ponalite and Mark Mackey. Teams are shaking hands. Big game here for St. Clair going back home victorious to start the season. Getting ready for the Pine Richland Tournament. Thanks to Jacob and Pelissari. This is Bob Hast and we will see you next time with Pine Richland in our home games.